In the previous video, we updated the tune player to play a list of notes in a table. Now we'd like to be able to display the lyrics at the same time the notes are playing. We can display text in a TuneSoap text block. It uh, consists of a title, in this case Hound Dog, and some text in the body. And uh, in this case, if I click the text block, it displays, you ain't nothing but a hound dog. It uh, would display whatever I put in the block. Uh, so for example, if I put uh, some text, then that's exactly what it's going to display. So um, the third column has the lyrics. So if I click item three of the first row, it gives me the text, you ain't nothing but a hound dog. So if I drop that into the text block, then I can display the text in that manner. So in order to uh, display all of the text, I need, as you might have guessed, a loop. And so I can um, just get rid of this. Um, I can create a script variable named phrase and the phrase is going to be what we display in the text box. And then we simply work our way through the script, uh, each time joining whatever was displayed before to the next item and uh, until we display all of the text or all of the lyrics that are associated with the song. So if I run the script, then it plays the, uh, displays the lyrics. It also displays the semicolons and the clear text and the semicolons we really want to tell us don't do anything and the clear text is our indication that we should clear the text and start another verse displayed. So uh, we can fairly easily add this uh, to our, we can add this uh, additional step. So now we can check to see if uh, there's a semicolon then don't do anything, just go on to the next item. If it's not a semicolon, if it says clear text, then we set the phrase to nothing uh, and blank the screen before going on to the next verse. Otherwise, we just joined the phrase to what was, has gone before and uh, display that. So here's how this would look in practice. You ain't nothing but a hound dog. You ain't never caught a rabbit, and you ain't no friend of mine. So now we can display the text at the same time uh, the, the music is playing. We can use the display text um, code that we've just developed to create a karaoke player that displays the text while the music is playing. So now we have a combined music and text display uh, procedure that can combine the two. And of course you could modify this in various ways. Uh, for example, you could create a karaoke player that played chords instead of notes if you wanted. We'll look into that and other enhancements in the next video.